A new diner is opening its doors in Cahos. The new owners noticed the spot during the city's popular Eat in the Street program last summer. News Channel 13 photographer Bill Webster caught up with the owner of the Tiny Diny. Three, two, one. Yeah. It's small, it's a tiny diny. We parked in front of the diner and there was a for sale sign in it. And we both said, hmm. Heard our little faces in the window and said, oh my God, look how cute. We came up with the name because it's tiny. It can only fit 10 now, COVID times. It rolled into our laps that way. We called the realtor, we looked at it. By early December, we were pulling down drop ceilings and, uh, and getting the party rolling. Space has been a diner. So far, we've tracked it back to the 20s. It's been a, a breakfast and or early lunch spot its whole life. I'm really thrilled to keep that legacy alive and, and bring it to life. I like knowing that this counter was here in 1922. Every month, we're going to break out and do a specials menu, so there's kind of wacky things on there. Right now, we've got some cloud eggs, which is a souffléed egg. I think it's a time for reinvention because we're, we're changing as humans at a rate that we don't normally change. The historic vibe of the city and, and uh, they're doing a great job. This city, if you're looking to start anything, this city is your city. They are excited, engaged, happy, supportive. Deputy Majority Leader as well as Chairman of the City of Tohoe's Democratic Committee, Gail Ethier. The mouthful, we got it all out this time. And for more info on the tiny diny at the corner of Remsen and Ontario Streets, go to our website, WMIT.com. We've set up a link. It looks adorable and so cozy.